Hey everybody, welcome to Heat My Shorts. It's a little bit later in the day today. It's actually, yeah, afternoon even. Been a little busy today. We finally got our car back. Um, got our steering pump fixed and the air conditioner fixed as well. So nice to have those things fixed before it gets too hot. And well, steering's always nice to have. Um, so a little bit later in the day. But anyways, before we get going, I want to thank all of you all 702 of you. That's right, we broke the 700 member barrier yesterday, actually. We got to 701 yesterday and 702 yesterday. We didn't lose anybody overnight. I kind of fully expect to lose a couple here and there, maybe even dip below 700 again, but we went above it once and we can do it again. And if we can do 700, we can do 1,000. So keep spreading the word. Thank you so much for everyone. All of the new subscribers, the old subscribers, if you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. Uh, hit the bell icon so you don't miss any videos. You'll get a notification when the video is posted, hopefully. And don't forget to like the video, share these videos, leave a comment down below. Thank you so much. I appreciate you so much. Honestly, like, I when I first started doing spice videos, that first drops of tincture, I didn't do it to get numbers. I didn't do it to do anything like that. I just wanted to share my experience with all of you. And a lot of you really enjoyed and appreciated that. And it really drove me to do better and better. And now this is kind of like a part-time job for me. It's, it doesn't pay anything yet, but it pays in love. It really does. Like yesterday I was down in the dumps and I got an awesome message and saw a really nice video that really brightened my day. So. Thank you all so much. I love you all. I appreciate you all. I mean that. I really mean that. I can't stress that enough. You are awesome. So I'm a little bit distracted. There's stuff going on next door. Pure leader truck next door. I'm a little bit worried they're delivering at the wrong house. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Lots of people get del deliveries around here. We've been getting quite a few lately. Anyways, <clears throat> pardon me. Um, let's get to a review, shall we? I'm really stoked about this one. Today we're going to be reviewing our first product from our friend Floyd at Sergeant Dunn's Beef Jerky down in Sterling, Illinois. So I've never tried, I don't think, have I tried anything? No, I've tried the tincture that was a collab with them, but other than that, I'm trying to think, I've never tried any of his beef, dir beef jerky, that's for sure. Um, this first one is Wicked Ranch. Now. Not too terribly long ago, maybe a month or two ago, Floyd actually messaged me and said he wanted to chat and he wanted to help us because we were not doing too well. You know, we were struggling to get by. We had half, you know, half our household is, is able to contribute an income that really makes things tough. So Floyd reached out and said he wanted to send us some stuff to review and enjoy just to just to spread the love just to show his appreciation. So he sent us a couple bags of jerky, some Mama Dunn's spicy sweets, some keychains, which I actually don't know where those are at the moment. Those actually might be on the, on the Rebel base over there. But <clears throat> today we're gonna re be reviewing Wicked Ranch flavored beef jerky from Sergeant Dunn's Beef Jerky. I'll show you this as well. This is how you can get a hold of Sergeant Dunn's Beef Jerky. Now, I see actually now that there is not an ingredients list on this. I haven't looked at it too closely. I looked at the, I looked at this, but you can't see much through the front there. So I put it in the freezer actually and took it out, I don't know, a week ago or so, a couple days ago. And it's funny actually, cause yesterday I had planned on doing this. And uh, yesterday Floyd actually messaged me and asked me, hey, you plan on doing any of those reviews soon? It's funny cause I actually, yep, tomorrow. <laughs> so that's really funny. Funny timing, and uh, I appreciate you reaching out, always. Let's open this up and see what it's all about. This is Sergeant Dunn's Beef Jerky, veteran owned since 2020. This is Wicked Ranch. I've heard great things about Sergeant Dunn's Beef Jerky, but I have not tried it yet. I already mentioned that. Somebody's coming over. That's hilarious. I'll show you a close up of this stuff. 
Yeah, that's a really nice looking beef jerky for sure. Yeah, it's thin, it's dry. Let's do this. Maybe? Maggie's licking her lips. Let's try this out. So Sergeant Dunn's beef jerky, this is Wicked Ranch beef jerky. My mouth is watering so much. It smells sweet. Mmm. Mmm. That's tasty. And you know what? It does have a slight ranch flavor to it, for sure. That's very interesting. That's really good. Mmm. <laughs> Very chewy. Yeah, it's very zesty. It's got a nice bite to it. It's not overly ranchy, but it's that ranch bite. It's not spicy. I mean, maybe a Slight bit of heat to it. Slight. I'm sorry, Maggie, I can't give you this. <laughs> hmm. It's very tasty but not overly flavored. It's not an overpowering flavor, but it's really nice. This seems to be really good quality meat. I don't know much about, you know, the grade of the, the jerky, but when I think of jerky, I'm not really, I mean, no, I shouldn't say that. I was gonna say I don't like wet, soft jerky, but no, I do, I love it. If it's like smoked salmon sort of jerky, I like that too. But I think this is what jerky should be. It should be dry, it should be thin, it should be stringy, right? It should be like kind of, you know, sinewy. I think that's a word. Um, yeah, chewy. It should take you a while to eat a piece of it. It shouldn't be like, you know, it shouldn't be like eating a piece of hot dog. This is good jerky. This seems to be a very, very good quality jerky. The seasoning is on point. You can always add tincture to it if you want more heat. I don't think this gets me to a one out of 10. I'm gonna eat this last piece of this. Mmm. That's great jerky. So, my heat scale, it like almost moves my needle. It's not a one out of 10. I don't even think it's a 0.5 out of 10, but I can detect there is some sort of bite in there. Maybe that's just the spices from the ranch. I'm not really sure, but zero to 10 on my heat rating. Your average habanero consuming chili head might find it to be a one or a two out of 10. Um, somebody new or sensitive to spicy foods might consider it to be like a, I don't know, maybe a three or four, maybe. I don't know, it depends on how, how sensitive you are, I suppose. Flavor, out of 10. That's like a, I wanna give it a 10 out of 10. I'm trying to constructively 
you know, think of how I would take even a half a point away, and I'm not coming up with anything. The only thing that me personally I would change about it is maybe, I don't know, Wicked Ranch sounds like it's going to be painfully hot, but um, I do have something wrong with me, with my heat meter, clearly, so maybe I'll have to get a second and third opinion on that. Um, and I, I always want more heat. Unless it's pure capsaicin, then I'm pretty good on the, you know, pretty good on that level, but that's the only thing, the absolutely only thing. But I mean, the taste is wicked. It tastes excellent. It's deadly. It's so good. So in that sense, yeah, absolutely wicked ranch. Totally. Um, so that's me absolutely trying to pick it apart. It's a great product. Um, it's a heavy bag. There's, we got two. We have a different flavor as well. But that like barely even put a dent in that bag. That's a good size bag of jerky. It's a shame that you can't see it a little bit better in the bag. You can't really tell how much is actually in there. Maybe if we do this, maybe you can kind of tell. You can kind of see it. It's a good slab of. I mean, not one slab, but a good mound of jerky in there. Definitely want to conserve this. I'm not sure, sure if this is supposed to be left in the freezer or not. I should ask Floyd about that, or even any of the other. Actually, to be honest, I think the thing about this stuff is it doesn't last long enough to put it in the freezer. Maggie is super interested in it. Let's get back here. Um, let's give it a texture rating. As far as jerky goes, 10 out of 10. Flavor, 10 out of 10. Texture, 10 out of 10. Heat, 0 out of 10 for me. <laughs> Look at her! <laughs> um, would I recommend that stuff? Absolutely. If you like beef jerky, if you like ranch, if you like a good flavored, <laughs> delicious meat snack, you are hilarious. Yeah, that's great. That is excellent. I would absolutely recommend that. Pardon me. I would absolutely restock on that as well. And apparently so would Maggie. Maggie absolutely recommends it, and she hasn't even tried it. Hey, does that smell super yummy? Yeah, Maggie says absolutely. Um, other than that, there's not too much else to talk about. Uh, the website, again, is www.sergeantdunnbeefjerky, D-U-N-N, beefjerky.com. Um, I will, um, of course, leave that link down below uh, in the description box as well. Uh, and I'll also link his YouTube channel. I'll also leave his YouTube ch channel on the end screen as well, but we'll get to that. We're still having our little Maggie hangout. Maggie seems pretty sore. She's definitely sore. She's definitely, you know, hip dysplasia is a very common thing in Golden Retrievers, unfortunately. And that seems to be what's going on. She's so, showing all the symptoms, all the signs. Um, Lady Shorts is doing a lot of research and a lot of Googling, a lot of asking around. We'll just do everything we can to make her as comfortable as we can. Right, Maggie? Except for giving her our beef jerky. Because that's what she's saying right now. She's saying that's, that's all I actually need is beef jerky. <laughs> yeah, I know, Maggie. Me too. That's all I really need to. <laughs> you are such a good girl, Maggie. Me? Right? You're such a good girl. Um, not too much else to talk about other than that. I just want to thank you all again. There's 702 people watching, not necessarily watching these videos, but subscribed to this channel. 702 people in the Heat My Shorts family. We are a family. This channel is a community. It's a family. It's a place for everyone. As long as, as long as you're respectful on this channel, you are welcome here, and uh, I'm happy to have you. I'm so proud of all of you. Honestly, this isn't this isn't just me. This is all of you. With without all of you, this would just be me here, just me and Maggie and Lady Shorts. But you make this 702 strong, and we're gonna keep going. We're gonna keep going for years. This is what I do now. I know I've said that a few times. I've thought about stopping a couple of times when I have a bad day, but usually just turns out to me just needing a couple of days off. Everybody needs that, even if I'm just making videos of me eating snacks and hot sauces. Everybody needs a break from, you know, things. 
you need time. Maggie's licking my toe. She's kind of strange. Um, so anyways, I'm gonna wrap this video up here. Once again, make sure you get a hold of Sergeant Dunn. Thank you very much, Floyd. This is super cool. This is actually, honestly, amazing jerky. I want to say maybe, probably maybe the best jerky I've ever had. I don't know. I've had some, a couple of people have made some amazing homemade jerky. The best jerkies I've ever had are all the homemade stuff, but this taste is just on point. It's delicious. Great job, Floyd. I can't wait to try the other bag, which is still in the freezer. So, I'm going to wrap this video up here. I hope you all have an awesome day. It's been such a good day here. Awesome day here for sure. So, hope the same for you all. Um, in this corner, you'll see our Heat My Shorts logo. Make sure you click that. Click subscribe if you're new here. Let's see if we can drive that number up even further. Get 800 soon. In this corner, Sergeant Dunn's Beef Jerky's YouTube channel. Hop over there, give him a subscribe, and check out some of his content. Up here, two relevant playlists for you to enjoy. I love you all. We will hang out again soon. I promise. This has been Heat My Shorts with Maggie and Steve. The Maggie Show. Bye-bye.